and stole a Pacific police car and then led police on a chase on Highway 44. Fox 2 Zara Barker is live from near where that pursuit ended near Bourbon and Leesburg. Zara. Yeah, the Pacific Police Department tells me this all started with a crash and ended in a chase. That's when things got interesting. Pacific Police Captain Don Locke says officers responded to a crash around 4 Wednesday afternoon on I-44 and took one of the drivers into custody on suspicion of driving under the influence. While in custody, the man somehow made his way into the driver's seat of the police car and fled. That's when the MoDOT webcam caught the chase down I-44 and witnesses say they saw a large response. I saw like 19 cops, I think it was, on the highway and then some that were on the service road and they were going that way and then I saw some get off of the highway from the other direction and that they wrecked just right down the road, the next exit, I think. Viewers sent us these photos of the scene showing a traffic backup and multiple authorities on scene. Police then used spike strips to stop the man driving their police cruiser on I-44 just west of Bourbon. That's when they took the man into custody once again. And Pacific police tell me that they will continue to investigate this incident and find out how the suspect got into the driver's seat of that patrol car. For now, I'm live in Crawford County, Zara Barker, Fox 2 News.